Hi guys, it's Cav here from DartsFanet.tv. Today, the other seven Premier League challengers have been announced. Of course, we knew who the first two challengers were because Barry Hearn announced them on the night of the World Starts Championship that Peter Snake bite right one. He announced that John Henderson was going to be making a return to Aberdeen after that epic night last year, which I was absolutely buzzing about. And Fallon Sherrick was going to be uh, playing in the Nottingham Premier League. As always, all the graphics are over here. Let's have a look at the other seven challengers that have just been announced. Announced. So for the Cardiff Premier League night, we've got Johnny Clayton. Uh, Dublin, we've got Willie O'Connor. Uh, in Exeter, we've got Luke Humphreys. In Liverpool, we've got Stephen Bunton. In Newcastle, we've got Chris Doby. And then for the doubleheader in Rotterdam, we've got Jeffrey Desvan and Jermaine Watamina. So they are the nine challenges for this year's Premier League. As always, leave your comments below because I want to know... Are you surprised by any of the players that are in? Is there some in there that you think shouldn't be? Is there players in there uh, that have not been selected that you feel deserve a place? I've got to get this off my chest right now. I'm absolutely devastated for Ian White. I know people are going to say that the Premier League are local to the players and that. But if, for me, Ian White, I know he doesn't always, always perform at his best on TV. Um, he had that run at the end of last year um, in the Players' Championships at Minehead Bear. But... You know, I just think for what he's done and how well he plays on the floor and what he wins, he really do uh, deserve a challenger's night in the Premier League. That's just my opinion. But let me know if there's any other players that you think that have been missed out or, like I said, some that you don't feel uh, should have been selected. Keep an eye out over the next couple of days. Got some really cool videos coming out for some players that are going to Coup School that Matt interviewed. Great videos they are. And as always, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Turn on your notifications. Um, and keep an eye out for all our videos. We've got so much exciting stuff happening in 2020. I'll catch you all soon, guys. Bye.